My name is Jillian and this is Jillian Camps Arizona and today we're going to be doing a thousand mile review of a mallet. I bet you're thinking to yourself, Jillian, how can a mallet get to a thousand miles? Well, let me tell you, if you're driving in a car, you got to bring one of these babies every single time you go camping, otherwise you're going to have a bad time. So these can easily get to a thousand miles. And like I said in the unboxing video, uh, it's really important not to bring something heavy like this when you go hiking, right? This is for car camping situation only. Car camping is when you bring your car, right? And you park right at the campsite. So you don't have to worry about packing anything in because this is heavy, okay? A mallet like this is extremely heavy. So, you know, just use caution when using this at all times and you'll be fine, you know? And especially in Arizona where the ground is really hard, and it can destroy the hook on this end, which as you can see what's happened because this is the old hook, right? And the new hook, as you can see, is significantly thicker. However, it is also bent. So, you know, what are you gonna do? So anyways, so this is a thousand mile review. I thought I'd show you how chewed up it is from striking. As you can see, I'm not too great at hitting a hammer, so to speak. It, you know, there's like giant chips out of it on both sides. So, you know, but it still works as a mallet. You know, it's just getting chipped to hell. And now that it's really, you know, rubber, it dries really fast here in Arizona. You find that in cars, right? Nothing rusts down here because there's no rain. However, it does, the rubber starts to disintegrate. It breaks down because it's so hot and dry. That's what happens that's what's starting to happen, especially with this mallet. You can see that it's just really dry. And the, once you get one chunk taken out of it on one side, it just, it accelerates that process. So it just really gets in there and you can see that it's completely dried out, you know, this side of the mallet, especially. And you can see where, you know, it's just been accelerating that process of drying and it's not as black and shiny as say the new one that I bought, right? So which is this one. So you can see there's a stark contrast in the differences, you know, between the new one, which is shiny, you know, more healthy rubber, I would say, not as dried out and cracked and starting to really accelerate. And as opposed, you know, to this old one, which, which is, you know. So the only thing I would recommend, again, on these is to replace the tent pole stake puller, right? Just simply take out uh, the the tiny flimsy item that it comes with and put in a stronger one, you know, but just be careful when using it in the Arizona desert, because as you can see, I've already pulled up, uh, the ground was too hard one time and I tried to yank out a stake and this is what happened. This huge one bent in, from the force, right? So it's gotta be careful when using a mallet like this or when using a tent puller, tent stake puller, such as this, you just have to be careful, right? But that's the thousand mile review. As you can see, I already bought another one because you know, this one's starting to get too dried out. And I've owned this for about five years. You can pick them up at Walmart. I always go to Walmart and get them, sue me. It's like 5.99 at Walmart. So, you know, go ahead and pick yourself up one of these. They're cheap, they're easy to use, and they come and they look like this. So that's all I wanted to say about the thousand mile review of this. Thank you so much for joining me on this Jillian Camps Arizona video. Feel free to thumbs up this content if you liked it and you want to see more like it. Also, if you're not currently following me and you want to follow me around, feel free to hit that subscribe button below. Or you can like my page on Facebook or on Instagram. That's at Jillian Camps Arizona. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.